please describe the status of the coffee industry in your country. The industry in Ghana, uh, some years back, you know, started very well. And, uh, you know, as you know, Ghana produces a lot of cocoa. So cocoa farmers were asked to go into coffee production and they obliged. But as you know, the production started coming up somewhere around the late 90s to the early 2000s, you know, the collapse of the world market price, you know, affected them so badly. Uh, their coffees were not bought, they lost interest, and most of them abandoned their farms. And uh, some of them, you know, went to uh, the production of cocoa and other crops. Yes, but since the prices started, you know, uh, recovering, uh, some of the farmers have gone back to their farms. And the government itself, from last year, November, to uh, 2010, you know, started supporting a pilot uh, revamping of the coffee industry. And this involved uh, focusing on areas where coffee has a comparative advantage because coffee competes with cocoa and other crops. So areas where coffee has the comparative advantage in terms of climate, in terms of soil, that's where the program is focusing, so that the farmers are being helped to you know, revamp their coffee farms. And this program is uh, about one year old now. What is the contribution of coffee growers to the national economy? The contribution of coffee growers is very minimal for now. It's very minimal. But, uh, and we can, I can't even put a percentage on it because the production is quite low as compared to the major you know produce of Ghana which is cocoa. What are you taking away from this forum? Yes, that is to assist the farmers you know to go back to uh, coffee production and indeed the time is now because this is a time that you know we are being told that demand for coffee is lagging behind supply. This is a time that you know, we also need to you know, look at other markets and, in, and also look at internal you know, uh, consumption. Once we are able to do that, you know, could we take part of our own the, the coffee that we produce by consuming them you know, lo locally and also looking at you know, non-traditional uh, markets and then emerging markets, we think that you know, we'll be able to uh, keep the balance between demand and supply. And as I hope that you know, the, 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 the situation that you know, uh, coffee farmers went through you know, uh, early 2000s you know, will not get there. Will not get there. So that is the hope. So what we are taking home is that you know, there's a conference that you know, we've you know, shared ideas, we come to a common ground that we, that we need to move as Africans, to uh, uh, position ourselves with respect to the production and even value addition of the coffee that we produce in Africa. What is the status of SMEs in your country? Yes, the SMEs, you know, they are more or less you know, the pivot of our economy. Yes, if you talk about cocoa, as I said, you know, most of them are small scale, and they produce, you know, almost all the cocoa that, you know, Ghana, you know, uh, exports, yeah. right? So they are very important, and, you know, they are recognized as such.